our back to school week here on daytime and to end our special we are talking school lunches it's a great way for families to save money but sometimes it's hard for parents to keep things interesting i spoke with james buttig vice president of retail sales about the variety they offer all right, so like back to school time is a great time for our products. Uh, you get a lot of interesting things for the pickiest kids out there. We have a, a wide variety of items. And so we try to do a lot of fun things for them, you know, for the school time. So a variety of uh, sliders to pinwheels to snack items. You no, know, we try to do a, a lot of things for the kids. And you guys are a family owned company. Yeah, so we're celebrating our 81st year wow. this year. Uh, we're fourth generation. I work with my uncles. I have an aunt in the business. I have uh, siblings and cousins. We've been a part of like the south side now in the far south suburbs for since the days of the stockyards. Do you have a favorite on here? Oh, pretty much everything on here I could, okay. I could pick apart pretty easily. I love our two ounce beef. It's one of our most popular items. It's what guys in the business. Yeah, I should mention because you have multiple sizes out here. Yeah, so we have a lot of things, different price points, different family needs. So we have our smaller, most known for our smaller size. Okay. For, you got a bunch of varieties there. Mm -hmm. But also for like those who are feeding a lot more, like miles at home. Yeah. We have our larger size too, all available in the Chicagoland area. I, I like these because I feel like, you know, the, the, the kid who's got practice after school, you can also throw an extra one of these in for a snack and you crackers. Could snack it, you can put it as a snack, you can put it up between two pieces of bread, you can eat it with like fruits and veggies. It's got a lot of flexibility. Yeah, because I mean, it gets expensive if they're gonna eat in the cafeteria. Everybody's trying to save a little money. Bringing their lunch is a really good option. We have a lot of perfectly priced items for all like price points and for everyone out there. Because if you want to uh, you know, have your lunch at school, bring it in, we have a great, great options for you. Well, and I like when you, when you lay it out like this where we can actually see what we can put in our lunches because I get in a lunch rut all the time. Yeah, so yeah, a little creativity, a few like uh, cookie cutter ideas that can yeah. really help and like brighten things up a little bit. So these are some great ideas that we've put together that are like great for all kids of all ages. Yeah, and I like it's not just your typical ham, it's not just your typical turkey, you've got the honey ham, you've got the black forest ham, so absolutely. if you got picky eaters, they're gonna find we have, something. We have plenty of options for everyone. Do your kids have favorites? So my kids, they love, again, the, the small pouches because they're those pretty tiny, so they don't need a whole lot. Yeah. So we have a bunch of these in our fridge all the time. All right, grab those phones and scan the QR code for more recipe ideas. You can also visit budig.com or follow Budig on Facebook or Instagram at Budig Lunch Club.